Yeah. You saw it, right? I did. Darn it. What did I do or not do? Nothing really. Uh, that's just a little temperament study. That, you know, uh, that all of them's been kind of similar, been a little slow, a little lazy. Yeah. But here's the thing. Uh, so. Let me see that. <coughs> what you do. So you are slow. Yeah. You are pulling too slow. I am. Right. So I mean, for what I like, I'll say that. So when you put this out, but then, you know you want that thing really buzzing, and then when it's there, and hey, you got to go, you know if you're coming in, if you're coming in like <coughs> slow, slow, like yeah, that right there, right, and then he's there, you know if he was there, you got to you got to go pretty good. Okay. So here's a here's kind of. A, Spill. I'll give you my spill. Yeah. <laughs> so, muskies are like race cars. They only eat in fourth gear. Okay. okay. So your job is to get them to fourth gear. All right. Okay. So, if he wanted to eat that bait way out there, he would have ate it. He's faster than you can reel it. Right. Okay. So you can't reel it fast enough to take it away from him. Okay. All right. So you don't want the blades to break the water, but you want it zinging through there good, right? Okay. And, and cruising and then th that gets that fish moving so he's in you know so when he's cruising he, like that fish right there he's like in second gear he's just kind of cruising following your bait right so what when you go out there and you're like 20 feet from the boat that's what i say when you do your rod tip to the left like that to yeah. get ready so you, you're using the same speed and he's in second gear and you gotta assume he's there all right you can't see it yet but he's there every time yeah all right so he's coming in and then you move, swap your, you keep the same speed, swap your rod to the left, and that will pulsate that and speed it up just a little bit, right? Yeah. So he's behind it. You go to the left, he gives him a kick. So now he's coming a little faster. You see it. There he is. You go a little faster right here at this turn and get him to go from second or third gear into fourth on that corner okay. and get him to hit. All right. Because right? if you just see him in second gear all the time, like slow rolling the blades like you you wasn't slow rolling it but like the bigger blades a lot of guys because it's so hard to roll it yeah you know, if your bait's coming in like this yeah no good okay. not that you can't catch one that way yeah but that's no good okay you want that bait coming in so not above obviously not above the water but but close yeah i mean you're you know even if i'm burning them like in this shallow stuff here you'll you can see my bait the whole way yeah right now, the whole way you'll see it out there and bulge in the water right All right okay but the key is if you try to get if you try to get that fish to go from second to fourth right here at the boat like you see it and it's in second nine times out of ten it's too late, gonna happen. It's too right. late. Okay. you gotta assume he's already there give him that little kick and then okay there he is and then rip her in there and pause it on that turn okay that's practice yeah yeah for sure so when you have a hot one that one was pretty good but he wasn't hot hot you could tell he wasn't tail kicking yeah um, that's the longest <laughs> that's those two fish i've seen are like the longest i've ever actually seen a fish follow my like watch to follow oh yeah like that yeah i don't really i don't know maybe they're there and i'm just not seeing them or something but that's 